Not sure these nightmare cutscenes are serving any purpose at this point. We know he's having nightmares. Just skip straight to the memo. No? No talking to Red? What the hell, man? He's like, running out of energy. Is Tokyo okay? Or are those nightmares just... Oh, old man had a partner. Old man in neutral, okay, we, we know about old man in neutral, yes. I don't know, she suspects this was a setup. Sounds a bit paranoid. Wait, maybe hidden camera in her office does... Oh, oh what? A bat? Underground documents about mayoral elections. Let's see if it's any fun. The bats have tails. Probably. emails has he got from the bat in this case? One? Was there a second one? Well then, let's read the Daily Mail. A soft answer is a specific cure of anger. I'm sorry, could... These are translations of Japanese sayings, I guess? and they couldn't find an equivalent, they just translated it directly. Right. Now it's nice that this game got a localization, was officially translated and released, but they could have done a little more work with the... No, localization part. At least, we're not eating hamburgers with chopsticks, but still. Oh, haven't seen Tetsu in a while. What's happening? That's quite an achievement. Subway? Uh, possibly. Wait, did... Did Tokyo not send that email? A girl got addicted to the internet and went missing. that about? I 
I guess Tokyo now's, now knows the story about the missing girl. I suppose it's the alien abducted missing girl. Red. Oh, that's the usual. Oh, we're not going to wipe it. Tokyo was about to wipe it. But now he doesn't want to. Oh, great. Well, that's suspicious. That was a productive conversation. No, nothing here. Oh, they, they are skipping the dream. That's, that's interesting. There was no nightmare. Good. So we're no longer seeing any nightmares. It even sounds shitty. Why? Why does the bat sound shitty? Something about Japanese I don't know. Something is totally up with that turtle. Oh, Sude is a master of misdirection. Hello there. Otherwise you're going to die. Oh. So if he gives up on everything, he's going to be mortal? I don't think so. Time we read a reward for one's way. Whatever. I think he misses the nightmares.
You know, it could be interesting if there were a case where these dates at the start of each day actually start going backwards or something. And this whole thing becomes a nightmare. Maybe they won't go as far. Ooh, weekly mail. Hmm, yesterday dealt with a person known as Slash. Stop. Right, pathetic kind of woman. Spend days in front of her computer. Okay. Now let's read about... Uh, what was it? Carnivorous plants. Yes. I haven't had one of those in this particular case before. Tiny Dancer. Producing a documentary. Nervous plants are being sold at department stores. Yeah, they're getting popular. That's nice. Daily Mail. I'm sorry. What? I mean, I suppose they will if you leave them there. Yes. You've lost my game. Let's see if we hear any news about a person named Slash being dealt with. Why did we have that scene? Maybe, oh yeah, maybe to like tie up a loose end. You know, Tokyo did try to find out whether someone was murdered, and they were in a meeting. He wasn't planning to tell his boss about the bats, but now he's asking for help. Even the facts would be okay. Oh no, nothing, anything but facts.
He just posted a bunch of notices asking random people on the internet to find the bat. Could work? Could be fun. No nightmare again. A disappointment. window. We clean the window for once now. Erica? Alright. Let's tell Erica something, maybe? Yeah, no one else is replying. It's annoying. cell phone. Oh! This guy. When was the last time we met him? First case? That was the boss. We're going back to the restaurant. Oh no, empty lot. Wait, empty lot? Uh, somewhere near the train tracks. Is he the bat? That would be ridiculous. Oh, great. That's it. A friend in need is a friend to be avoided. This is suspicious as hell. The music is new too. Hmm. Especially lonely empty lot. Is the bat. 
Yeah, he's missing his glasses. And maybe that's not... Maybe that's not the guy. Maybe he faked his voice? Yeah. Oh, not the not the Kamui case. Oh, you mean the situation is not the case. This is this is confusing. Explains everything. Blackout. Oh, that's contact. Isn't she on death row? Oh wait, he, he's already told us this before, like in the first case. Yeah? What, about to have a heart attack?
He's got a gun. Wasn't the pack of placebo green? Or is it a new design? Who's driving? Have you been shot? No, oh, he's dead. Good. Oh, a sniper shot him, I guess. That's interesting. Tokyo's got his guardian angel. Sure, go to Typhoon, not to Tetsu. I don't know, he doesn't want to talk to the police at this point. Let's talk to Red. Don't want to talk to Red. And you don't want to talk to the window. Fine, computer it is. She was quick to reply. Are we going to do it by email? Ah yes, the chat, that, that has been so secure so far.
Um, what were you talking about? Okay, she's, she's very dedicated to her journalism. She looks angry. Well, this has been enlightening. Something is something's happening. Red is moving. And makes sense. Window. Fine, let's touch the computer. No, nothing? So, what the hell just happened? We found out about the bat. We really got no new information about the case in Transmitter. It's like a completely parallel story. I mean, there is some connection, but it's very limited. And most of it was just about Tokyo. Which is kind of nice. Let's recap more new information. So, next time, let's go to Transmitter and Lifeguard, because I don't know what's going on on this side anymore. Is this the last case, or the penultimate one? I think going by the music could be the last big case. Okay, let's do it next time and see what Yasu is up to after he solved the internet.